there is a, an absolutely rank smell in the car and it smelt like resin, like the 3D printing resin. What's going on guys, welcome to today's vlog. It's Saturday the 6th of October. Me and Alpha have just been up to the unit. We've dropped a load of stuff off from out the old utility room and we've picked up some Halloween decorations. We're gonna be decorating the house later on today or starting the decorations for the Halloween season. We always decorate the house ridiculously well for Halloween and also equally, if not better, for Christmas. So the room that I've just cleared at the house and took the stuff up to the unit, that's gonna be turned into Aurora's nursery. So it'd be like a nursing room for Sarah where she could sit with Ava, um, you know, and just, because she's planning on breastfeeding, so she could go in there and breastfeed and stuff like that. Just have a little bit of a chill out zone. She can also uh, bathe her in there and stuff like that. So that should be pretty cool. So that's now cleared. We've got rid of all the crap that's got upstairs into this unit, which is, when you look at the, the size of the, the rubbish that we've moved, you wouldn't believe that it fit in that tiny room. It's ridiculous. So I'm just about to head over to the co-op now with Alpha because we've got a load of parcels that need delivering, you know, considering we don't sell anything on eBay. We're absolutely rammed. And then later on this evening, I've got to go back to the unit because the unit, the office. This is the unit, I've got the office. I don't know why it's so hard for me to remember. So I've got to go to the office later on and try and sort the two G-Tech printers out because at the minute, they're not running properly. They're running like one of them is, um, not level properly and the other one basically the bed just rocks all the time so we're gonna have to sort both of those out we've also i think we might be coming back later on as well to do like a halloween scene i'm not too sure on that so um if we don't we don't but i think that's being planned but sarah's currently cleaning all the downstairs with chloe they both blitzed the, the top part of the house and now they're going downstairs to the bottom part of the house Portia has gone out today with her friends, dropped her off earlier. She's gone to the um, Ashton Moss with um, her friends from school. Uh, the first time she's ever been out with just her friends, they went and seen, I think they got a scene, Johnny English, and then they're gonna go get something to eat from McDonald's. So she feels really grown up and really responsible. And she's 11 in a couple of weeks, so why not? One of the uh, kids' parents are there, but they're not staying with them. They're just staying off in the background just so they feel like they're on their own, which is great. So I'm going to be picking her up later on. She rang me about 20 minutes ago and said she was just about to go in the cinemas. So I said, fine. And then she's going to obviously go get something to eat. So it's been a busy day. It's freezing. I feel a lot better because I had some sleep last night. I got to bed early for us at around half 11. And then I obviously slept till about 11 o'clock this morning. So I feel completely refreshed. Although I do feel bad because I told Daz that I was going to send him some files over last night to print. And he was basically sat at the office since seven o'clock until 11 o'clock. So, uh, but he did build the cabinet for the one house. So that's a, that's a positive. So nice one, Daz. So yeah, we're going to get today started officially. Later that same evening. Hey guys, I thought I'd just check in with you and just Give you an update on what we've been doing today. So me and Chloe have been absolutely blitzing the house. We have blitzed the kitchen. We have done my bedroom. We've done the stairs and the landing. We've done her bedroom. So it's just been a full on cleaning day and it's the same tomorrow because we've got so much to get sorted before Christmas and like new carpets need putting down on the stairs and the landing and stuff like that. But we need to get the painting finished first. So hopefully I'm going to start painting the rest of the living room later on and then obviously I go on to the hallway, come down the stairs. But I might just start painting our bedroom wall, like this main wall here and round. And then obviously over that side. <coughs> and then obviously this room will be sorted almost. And I've found some wallpaper that I like, but I'm into mine's about it it's like a marble gray and white but i really can't decide i wanted something lighter because obviously that's really nice but it's just so dark so i just wanted something to lift the bedroom just simply because it is actually really dark in this bedroom all the time so just thought if it looked a bit lighter and a bit fresher it'd be a lot better but I still can't decide so once i've painted the gray then I'll probably make my mind up. I don't know whether we've shown you, but we bought um, 
Penelope's Halloween outfit. And it's so cute. Are you bouncing on my bed? Yeah. Why? And why are you drawing on your face when you've just cleaned your... You monkey. You're a monkey. What are you doing? Don't draw on your face. No. You've just had a wash. You a monkey. You're going to fall off the bed. You're a zombie. Yeah. <gasps> Tell everybody what we've got in the living room. What have you got in the living room? A witch. A scary witch. Yeah. You don't like her, do you? No. Because <laughs> that's scary when it talks. It's scary when it talks, isn't it? Uh -huh. What's She's got horrible eyes, are not she? We're going to do this. <laughs> Is that what she does? Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. You do this, you open my mouth like this. Right, we're going to wash your face again now. Hey. Hey. Eh? No, don't put no more on your face. Oh, I do. You're a monkey. Kitty. No telling him, is there? Yes, she still do it. No matter how many yes, times she's told not to do it. So, yes, it looks like I'm washing her again now. Yes, you, yes, you. Yes, you. She's actually got a purple face now. So, yes, I've cleaned yes, all yes, of my computer yes, unit. So, it looks all... Tidy and, and I've got all my candles lit that says mum and then obviously I've polished all of the sides and all this side. Dave's mum's having these. Now I've just got to clean this side because it's just a mess and I really need to think of something to buy to put on there so it stands on it all. And then I cleaned this side. Mom, so Mom, all of the do you have a face flat marks have gone now. Mom, do you have a face now? Oh, look. She's cleaning her face. Let me see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> keep, keep cleaning it. There's still some more. <laughs> I'm going to do a new one. No. Yeah. I just cleaned it off. Yeah. And wash you. <laughs> <laughs> eyebrows. Eyebrows. <laughs> Purple eyebrows. These, 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 these. <laughs> You're a monkey, ain't you? What are you <laughs> doing? <laughs> right, we get ready for bed. You're going to say goodnight to the guys. You're going to say goodnight. All right, say good night first. Yee! Say good night first. Nope. Okay. All right, they'll all cry now. We have two vanilla pears. Terrible twins. <laughs> so before when I was at the studio, I told you that Porsche was at. The cinemas with her friends and everything else. Just literally after I put the camera down, she actually rang me and told me to pick her up. So that's why we've kind of like jump cut it to now. We're just about to get Vanellope to sleep. Then we're going to go live on YouTube for half an hour because I've still got to go over to the unit quickly. The unit. Oh my God, it annoys me so much. Sarah's is the unit. Mine's the office. I've got to nip over to the office later on and just swap the prints over because I've just had another order come through now from Etsy. I think it's for a Pulse Rifle or Chewbacca's gun because... Uh, they're both the most popular parts of things. And what? Most popular thing that we sell, anyway. So, Sarah's been cleaning today like mad with Chloe. She's also been messing with the Lego. I can see it at the top of the shelf where she's knocked guns down and stuff like that. I've not she also, like she's a liar. She also, um, in fact, you can do it. Messed with one of my Imperial Star Destroyers because that's just the way she is. Rip the stairs out. They haven't got no way of getting up to the top the top deck now in that ship. So they're stranded basically in the canteen. Could be a good thing though if you may. You know, being as fat as I am and as much as I enjoy food, that'd be a good thing. Everybody likes to puckering lips up. Yeah. It's because he's been learning that much to do um, selfies on Snapchat. Yeah, I don't even know how to use Snapchat. I don't even know what Snapchat Snapchat is. Sarah deals with all the stuff like that. Because we know the dangers of the men in the house that can 
go off on Snapchat and stuff like that using other accounts and stuff. So I, mean that I don't I don't use Snapchat and everything else and I'm not that way inclined anyway. Yeah, still got an our family one but yeah, we haven't got an our family Snapchat one yet properly. Sarah's gonna be setting that up soon enough. She's uh doing the usual jumping on the bed. We all know how that ended last week when she jarred a knee. So can you imagine it? It's gonna be two of them. It's gonna be Aurora when she's six. When Penelope's six, Aurora's is gonna be three. And they're gonna be basically jumping around like lunatics on the, on the bed. I've got really bad indigestion. I've just had a sandwich, a baby and Chloe a sandwich. Too noisy. Once she's asleep, once we've finished the live, I'm sure we'll check in with you guys. All right guys, so we're at the office now. Me and Portia have nipped on over here because I have to set these prints off because I'm not, I'm not just saying it. I have literally got orders coming out of my mouth. It's just, it's ridiculous. Um, there was two more orders come through before for two more pulse rifles. And I want to show you something really quickly. We've started printing Christmas trees off. These are really cool, check these out. So there's two versions of this Christmas tree. There's a standard version of the tree, which is this which is in this beautiful festive green colour. It's just gorgeous, it reflects all the light. And then we've also got a contoured version of it which shows off more of the light, which is this one. So these are actually going for sale on our eBay page soon. I think they'll be pretty cool. And we're also doing ones where they cut the base out at the bottom and you can put a lamp inside them. So they'll, they'll look pretty cool when they're finished. So once we've finished here, Chloe's treat me and Sarah to McDonald's now. I know I've already had McDonald's this week, but I'm pretty sure because I've cut out all the uh, fizzy drinks and the monsters that I should be all right this week to still lose at least a pound, two pounds. I am back on it again this week. I've been out and bought some BCAA tablets, creatine tablets, all my multivitamins. I'm gonna do it properly next week with the vitamins because I've obviously lost a lot. So we did just go live. If you haven't seen it, the link's going up here. It was really good. It's fun to get on there. So we're going to finish off here. Then we're going to head over to McDonald's. Then we're going to go home. We're going to see Sarah and Chloe. And then we're probably going to end the vlog. <laughs> oh, and just one other thing as well before I go. There is a, an absolutely rank smell in the car. And it smelt like resin. Like the 3D printing resin. And we couldn't figure out where it was. And I have a tub that stores the um the prints in it it's like these tubs over here these ones so when i went in the back of the car before the whole tank has exploded in the back of the car and it's leaked out it is alcohol pure alcohol so it does evaporate but it's going to take a while to get the smell out of the car so uh, sarah is not impressed whatsoever all right guys gonna end the vlog there i hope everybody's enjoyed it today I just got back before I, before I go, before I finish the vlog. I just wanted to say a massive thank you to Maxine, who sent the girls a unicorn clock. Thank you very much. It's much appreciated, and it's gone in the girls' room. When we finished the unicorn room, we'll let you see it. And obviously, that's going to take pride of place on the wall. Uh, the girls really, really, really love the unicorn clock. So thank you, Maxine. So yeah, that's going to be the end of today's vlog. Tomorrow, we are putting all the Halloween decorations up with the kids. We started putting a few things up, like the little candles here. We've got the Halloween house in the corner. This is the Yankee Candle Halloween house. That looks fantastic when it's lit up. We're also going to be putting more stuff on the tree. We've got the old hag that's back up in the window. Everything in here is going to look like a crypt this time tomorrow night. If you remember last year, Naomi came with Daz and helped us. The video is coming up here. Check that out, it was pretty cool. And we also went live as well. So we're gonna be live again tomorrow night as well. So it's gonna be fantastic. So do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you click the notification bell, it does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day. <laughs>